Hi, Hiram here. Let me explain what I'm doing while I light this. The other day I did a boil test on this Evernew setup, the Stand DX with the burner inside. But I did it without the power plate, which you saw in the last video that it really makes a difference in the flames. I've got two cups of water here setting at 60 degrees. What I want to do is see how much the power plate changes the boil time and the run out time. So let's see how long it takes this to get to a boil. Okay, here we are at the two minute mark. The temperature is up to 100 and 910 degrees Fahrenheit. The room temperature is uh, 84 degrees, humidity 67% wet. It's sunny and very hot and humid outside. I think you can see that this uh, upper stand is starting to get all red. It's, uh, I don't know, just really, I have a thought about this. I'm going to have to work on it, but this thing is really acting as a real heat sink. It's getting the flames up fast, but it's really consuming the alcohol. But uh, it's just a thought I have that I have to work on. So anyway, let's see how long it takes this to get to a boil. There we are, 210. To 11. Come on. To 12 in 4 minutes 52 seconds. Okay, let's see how long this takes to run out. Okay, the temperature is dropping, the flames are going. Going. You can hear the titanium clicking, I think. And gone in 558. Hmm. 558. Okay, so. Not sure what this means. This was two cups of water. Starting at 60 degrees. With one fluid ounce of methanol. That was 25.2 grams of methanol using the power plate in there. Uh, this time it got the water to a boil in 4 minutes 52 seconds. On the test without the power plate, it took about 4 minutes 45 seconds. So using the power plate really made no difference. It's within like six, seven seconds. The uh, run out without the power plate was six minutes, 15, six minutes, 15 seconds. And then today it ran out in five minutes, 58 seconds or about what, 16, 17 seconds faster it ran out. So I don't know what the big benefit would be for this power plate except to use up the alcohol faster. It must have something to do with the cold weather. Uh, maybe this just doesn't work as well in cold weather and they figured they needed this power plate. But hmm, that's the way that one works. I have another sick idea that I'm working on with these holes. I've also been asked to do this in some sort of a breeze. I think they mean other than my talking I could use a muffin fan or something and rig up some sort of a uh, breeze coming through here. Because even though this is supposed to be a windshield, a lot of people have complained about it in a real breeze not working. That you need a windshield of some sort around it. Okay, so that's another boil test on this Evernew Titanium Stand DX with the Evernew Titanium Burner. I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.